Now we're going to show you how to install the Meteor framework on your computer. From the Meteor.com homepage, you can see there's a curl command that you can take and paste into a terminal window, and that'll download the latest version of Meteor for you automatically and get it installed. From there, you'll have the Meteor command available, which will allow you to create new apps. So I'm going to go into my projects directory, where I keep all my projects, and do Meteor create my app. That's going to create the directory structure and the files for the default sample app that they provide for you. If I run Meteor inside that directory, it'll start my server for me. And I'll see in a few seconds that it's running on localhost port 3000. So I can open my browser to localhost 3000 and my server is running.